Hello everyone and welcome back to the Latent Gamer. So today we're doing chapter one. And to be honest, chapter one is probably the most brutal so far. And the reason is this. You've got nothing. And by nothing, I mean you are not told what to do. You are not told where to go. You weren't even given a weapon. The only thing you learn is this. The oven in your house is what will keep you safe at night. All right, it emits a, a fume, right, that protects you from the evil spirits that are outside. And the other thing that you learn is that your character would mumble to himself most of the time that he needs some gas, right? Which is a plus when it comes down to nighttime. Because if you have light around your area, then you should be safe, right? But most of the time, you're going to be there in the dark and you won't know what's going on on the outside. You're going to hear a lot of creepy sounds and it's going to get you paranoid but you will be safe as long as you're inside where your oven is all right so because i didn't know what to do or where to go i realized that there's actually three regions on my map that i have to explore and to be honest i had no idea what to do so i saw x so i decided to go to that x all right turns out the x is actually an abandoned house with an underground passageway that leads to who knows where and i was here like contemplating what to do right and i was like yolo right so let's get going i'm not scared of anything and another interesting point is that when i was outside right you notice that i had a really wide peripheral with my so-called flashlight well actually found out that that's not the case right that's not a flashlight it's actually daytime and you can see in that view right now in this underground area this is a great example of what nighttime is like right uh, give or take a few things like for example take out that light right there the only thing that you will see is your character at night nothing else and it's really creepy and then there will be like evil spirits coming from all direction but let's just go through this area first and then we'll see what happens right on this creepy door and it turns out I don't have a key so I decided to turn back Now this is a great representation of what it looks like at night. Don't want to 
go that way. I don't know what that thing is, but this is actually the first time I got killed. So I stopped right and I decided, okay then, maybe I just need to like, find some people and talk to them, right? Since I don't know anything about what's going on, so... I went to this house first, and it turns out that there was actually two people on the inside, but... I think they were just busy, and they didn't want to come out, so... <laughs> Hello there! Maybe now is not the right time. And then I met this guy, who actually gave me some pretty good information, even though he kept calling me meat, right? He told me that I should go through the silent forest and then meet him on the other side, which is basically something like a, a test of strength or something. And then I went to the silent forest, and then this happened. Y'all ready for this? <laughs> Then I got the codes for the door, then I decided to break this egg and steal an embryo. Then I opened the door and when I got to the other side, this happened. Y'all ready for this? So when I woke up, I met this creepy guy, right? And he was like, hey, we should look out for each other. We should be brothers and stuff. So I ran. And I ran, and when I got tired, I took a breather, and then I ran some more. I actually found back my backpack, and I found back like, my embryo and everything, and now I'm almost halfway through the forest. Good thing I didn't meet those two guys again. That would be messed up. And now I finally made it to the other side. Then I found a new hideout, which is pretty good because I couldn't imagine going back through that forest again. And then I used that embryo to improve one of my physical attributes. So this will be the end of chapter 1 part 1. Thank you guys for watching. Please leave a like down below. Subscribe for more. And I'll see you in the next video, alright?